Hello everybody and welcome to a Minecraft tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make a bamboo, an automatic bamboo farm. So, this is a design that, I, I don't think it's the cheapest, it's just that it's really easily um, stackable. So that's why I kind of like it. Um, I don't know if anybody's done this, I, I guess so, because it's super easy to do. But anyway, I came up with this myself, so, um, if you don't include, like, because here, here's just a wall, because you need a wall in front of it, but if you just take the farm itself, it's three blocks wide, I think if you include this, but you technically don't have to, I think it's like seven blocks tall, yeah, um, because you do need a block here. You could have a, a slab would also work. No. So I'm gonna just show you how to do one unit, and then I'm gonna show you how to do this unloader. So first off, you want to start up with this. You're gonna want a power rail, top. You want a dirt block. That's this is where your bamboo's gonna go. You do this. Uh, you need a piston, a regular piston. I'm gonna put another block on top of it. Now you're gonna need an observer facing this way, so it will detect the, uh, you know. Um, then you're gonna want a note block. So that's this is where you actually need a block, and like I said, a slab would still work. Um, then you're gonna need an observer facing this way. Then another block. This needs to be a full block, no transparent blocks, because it needs to transfer redstone. Uh, so that's that's the farm, right there. You also, like I said, you need a wall there. So if you build it underground or something, it's fine. It's just you do need a wall there. And then I'm going to show you how to build the uh, little unloader. Not that far. So, um, I'm gonna build it a bit higher actually. So, you need power rails. Like, you don't need a specific length of power rails, it's just. One thing I. Oh, uh, one thing I should mention though is you need a separation between those power rails and those one over here. Because if not, it's, they're just going to stay powered. Alright, so what you want to do is having a block here. Uh, this, this, and this. So, so what you want to do is having a comparator facing this way. You want to have a block here with a torch. Place a block on top of it and a block on top of the torch. I'm gonna place some redstone. I don't like it that way, so I just do that, but it doesn't matter. So then you place your other power rail here. Then I'm just gonna just gonna make a little separation here just to show you how it works. Um that should do it. And then I'm gonna place the torch under it. So when you have a hopper minecart, what it's gonna do? Missed. So what it's gonna do is it's gonna pick pick it up, and it, as long as there's items in this hopper, it's gonna continue to it's gonna continue to unpower those rails. So I, I have to mention you do have need to either have a chest connected to this hopper or, or another hopper. It doesn't need to be facing that way either. Because um, if not, the items are just going to stay in here. So yeah, so it's pretty nifty unloader, really quick. It's not the quickest because I guess you could have hopper minecarts, but you know. Yeah, this farm. I built it in a survival world, and it's pretty easy. I mean, 
Like, I, I've built this exact same one with ten of those. Um, like, don't have any. I just want to show you that it doesn't trigger the one next to it. Never mind. Well, anyway, um, I thought it wouldn't trigger it, but I was wrong. But yeah, so it's not the most efficient. I mean, bamboo farms, if you would have, like, bone meal being dispensed in them, it would be pretty efficient. But it's just I have a lot of um, bamboo, so I don't really care about efficiencies. I just use it for fuel. And you can always expand on it. It's just so easy. Like, it doesn't get any cheaper than that. Well, I mean, I guess it could, but it's just two observer, one no block in the piston. And I guess you could have any system to pick up the items too. It's up to you. So the, the actual farm is just this here. So, yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.